this up. Uh, are you guys going to go and make yep, some we're, nice we're treats? We're getting into the kitchen. Sort out your bums. Right, so Joe. You are now going to make a lovely, a treacle tart, but with I hot am. crust buns. Yep, definitely. Let's get that. That's on. So, We're key done. ingredients. Key ingredients are hot crust buns. Yep. Pastry case. Okay. And with the zest of an orange, ginger, and ground cinnamon, some cream, and eggs. Okay. So this is basically a normal treacle tart. You have yep. your breadcrumbs in there. You do. What you've done is take your your hot cross buns and we're going to blitz them okay to make the breadcrumbs yep. so we're going to get a bit of spice in there mm -hmm. some raisins as well yeah it's a great way of using up old, old ones, ones. That, you don't want Not them obviously old. green and stale but <laughs> yes <laughs> yeah. well ben might after the other day <laughs> yeah but just uh just put them, so whisk them in we're going to whisk those in oh, okay these things go in that's it isn't there it we go. done yeah we're done Them up. Oh, I'm constantly holding the top of the yeah. thing. Sounds a bit like a helicopter. It does. <laughs> you just want quite a nice fine crumb. Okay. So you do want them fine? Yeah. Otherwise it might drive it jelly? Yeah. Mm. A bit more? A bit more. And while you're doing that, you've got here in your pan, you've got, you've got some golden, golden syrup, syrup. Yeah. which you'll just warming yeah. basically. So you don't want to make it boiling hot, no. you're just warming it through so you can combine yeah. everything together. So it's quite liquid. Okay. I think that will be fine now. All right. And then all we're going to do is pop those into the bowl. Yeah. And pop in all the chaos. Oh, do you know what? Isn't it? <laughs> that was therapeutic. I think yeah, the way Joe cooks married. is is beautiful. Do you know why? Because there's no boys here. Normally, I've got a house full of three <laughs> like boys screaming for things that <laughs> they <laughs> want. So, <laughs> so it's not this calm. is really calm uh, for me. Wait, well, what, oh, sorry, do I not count? <laughs> <laughs> you're calm. <laughs> you're, not, you're not really a boy. No, when the kids no. were little, I used to bleach myself into a corner in the kitchen and say, <laughs> "You can't come in, or you're going to burn your feet." <laughs> 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 Keep them away from you. Keep them away from me. They're terrible. So I'm, I've, I've taken over here you while you're chatting. I've taken over your orange. Instead of using a lemon, which you do How in, nice in normal treacle tart, I mean, the orange goes so beautifully really with well. it because of all the spices in that um, hot cross bun. Yeah. Which Russell Grant the other day, he was saying he couldn't find a hot cross bun that was spicy. Mm. So this would be just up Because we're going to add some more spice to it as okay. well. So there's so we've got orange. some ground cinnamon. Yeah. And some ginger. We'll add all the Ooh, ginger because I know ginger. you love it. I love, I love ginger. It's not as much of a fan of cinnamon. Cinnamon, so that's why better. I left a little <laughs> out. <laughs> so I'm just going to break three eggs into here just to make sure Would we don't get any shell. Would you like me to separate shell. the yolks for you, Joe? Are you all right? <laughs> no, I'm OK, thanks, okay. Ben. Just but give it me a was a real awesome trick. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you could just do it another time. Yeah. Yes. So I'm just going to grab a fork, OK, and give those eggs a little whisk. Do you want me to combine that? Yes, please, lovely. Can we pop the cream in as well? Yeah, put that cream in. Oops. Take those eggs out the way there. there will, you ever go, will you ever go this far mm. and bake a, a tart or a cake like this? Do you ever That's do that? Yeah. I, I, I like to do a Victoria sponge. <sighs> okay. Yeah. But I also like to learn. Yeah. So. Look, we need to be cleaning up. We are. This is a perfect <laughs> one for Easter as well, which is why we're doing it, isn't it? And yeah. you've got your tart case here that you've prepared earlier. Yes. So you've done some, you've blind baked we've it. Blind baked it, and then we've just washed it with some egg to give it that nice sheen. Yeah, just to give it that extra. So that gets it. So it's extra crispy. Yeah. So if you put you, you put egg wash on it before you put it in the yeah. oven, and then bake it. Um, well, I Afterwards. blind bake it, then take the um, paper and the beans out, then give it a wash, put Only it back five in. Five minutes. Yeah. Brilliant. So we're just going to pop the uh, filling okay. into the center. So that definitely avoids a soggy bottom, it doesn't does. it, Joe? It's not good to have a soggy bottom. It's not. <laughs> Is it, Ben? No, 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 it's not. <laughs> it's hard Mary to avoid Mary at times. Tell us. <laughs> there we go. So we're just going to put this into the oven. Okay. And how long does that go into the oven for, Joe? This goes into the oven. We've got things in the oven. Oh, let me take them out. We've, We've got, got my rice crispy chicken from earlier. There we go. We'll put them underneath. That'll keep the crew happy. There we go. And get that in. It's also a really good tip to do it on a tray, yes. baking tray, so you're not going to sort of walk along to the yeah. oven and it all falls out. And how long is that for? Down. That is for about... 25, 30 yes. minutes? Yes. Yeah, and then you want, so it sets nicely and then leave it to chill. Okay. 
Good Fantastic. stuff. Right, okay, while well, that goes and settles down in the cooker, we're going to take a short mm. break. Coming up, Joe's going to be finishing off a hot cross bun tree called Tart. Can't wait to have a taste. And we'll be sitting down to eat with Una, Vanessa, Zoe and Michaela. See you after the break. Especially Zoe. <laughs> Hello, welcome back to What's Cooking from the Sainsbury's Kitchen. We're here with the Saturday stars, Una, Vanessa, Waterloo Rogues, the actress, Sorry Lucker, and the lovely Michaela. And we're all waiting for our food. Yes, and Joe, before the break, you started showing us your hot cross bun treacle tart. I did, yeah. So remind us what you did before the break. We whizzed up some um, hot cross buns, and then we just warmed up some syrup, mixed it all together with a few other bits and pieces, and baked it off. Baked it off. And this is one that's cooled. This is one that's cooled. And a really good tip if you want to move cakes or tarts out of a loose bottom tin, you, should, yeah. you can use a ramekin, or if you're at home and you've got soup cans or oh, yeah, you know, anything, anything like tin. and just push it down. Oh, how Perfect. easy is that? And then we just not sure it's up there with my uh, yolk removing. Uh, <laughs> I uh, think it's up very good. Kind of, yeah, I don't know. Can we just no? Maybe I not. Maybe. <laughs> Tip two. Yes, it is a good tip. Bake. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously not if you don't bake. No, no. If you don't bake, it's rubbish. It is. <laughs> no, but whereas you separate eggs daily. I'm yes. just going to sit there separating <laughs> eggs on my own. <laughs> when I want a meringue next, I know who to Give call. Give me a shout, Joe. Yep. So look at this. There you have it. Joe Wheatley's hot cross bun treacle tart. Joe, should we take it over? Yeah, take it over. We've we'll got get some and we're going to serve it with some creme fraiche because that... With the acidity of the creme fraiche, it will cut through the sweetness. Oh, that would so be lovely. Good balance. Delicious. Not just your average bit of cream. Well, while you saw that out, of course, earlier on, uh, we were getting you guys to send in some pictures of you, what you've been having for Easter and all that, and we've got some lovely ones here. Emma Parker. There you go, look Aww. at Emma's little Easter bunnies, aren't they gorgeous? Aww. Thank you, Emma, for sending that in. His nine-year-old Jack Daniel. Um, <laughs> wonder where he got his name from. <laughs> He's got some cakes that have been made by his mum, Nicola Whitehouse. <laughs> Jack, the little Easter Tigger. Uh, we love getting those pictures. Do please keep them coming in. Uh, all the details of how you can get in, in touch with us are on the screen on the top, on the at What's Cooking top, TV. Yeah. Or you can email us, of course. We were talking uh, driving test disasters. A few of you have got in contact. Quinton says, ensure the instructor knows you're looking in your rear view mirror. So knock it yes. slightly. So it's, do you know that one? Actually, what I did was I tied my hair back in a high ponytail. So every time that I moved my head to oh. check my mirrors, my ponytail would swing. So that was showing that I was actually oh. checking See, my mirrors. We can't do that. Us <laughs> yeah, boys can't do that. Know, when they say turn left or turn right, you know sometimes you get mixed up. Obviously that's your left and right. But when you're <laughs> when you're when you're concentrating, so you might go, go right instead of left. So what I did was I wore a massive ring on my left. So when you say left, I think of the ring. Really? Oh, oh, yeah. Things like that. An R on my right thumb. You had an R <laughs> you did. on your thumb. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Is this really as hard as you're making out left and right? Yeah, I just, yeah. I just did some really obvious try to do. Oh, yeah. Then you kind yeah. of think your eyes are going off the road. But, but it's slightly least, worrying, yeah. is it? She's That's got a strange tick, this one. <laughs> uh, Tracy Roberts says her daughter had a mock test. A pheasant flew into the sign on the top of the car and ripped it straight off. Oh, oh, oh God. God. <laughs> that, not, not, not great. Thank you for those. Uh, we were talking earlier as well about Una and her husband who have set up a brand new uh, duo. Oh, no, this is an old one. It's, it's actually Banuna. retired now. It's retired it's already. It's my favourite. Let's just